Hi, welcome to the Vida de Vale. My name is Valentina and we're gonna do a last minute packing video. It is now, I think it's seven o'clock. I take off tomorrow. I have to be at the airport like by 7 a.m. Um, so we need to do some packs I have not done. Any. And we'll start off uh, by saying if you uh, like this video, please like like button. And I would love it if you subscribe to my channel. Let's get right into it. First, I am going to show you my suitcase. This is from Away. So our suitcase is from away and it is the um carry-on one that does have the battery have kind of started i started last night right before bed this is my gym clothes yes i am that person uh, i do work out when i'm on vacation even if it's like a hit workout i have to do something and then so i'm gonna put the rest of my clothes here and this is gonna be my bathing suits um sports bras and then undies you don't know how many times I've traveled and I've underpacked on underwear and so like the last day before we leave or the day of I've had to go commando and I'm not about that life I'm really not I've tried it it's just not for me so I overpack on underwear because I wear different underwear from when I sleep than during the day and then when I work out I also change my underwear after so I change my underwear about three times a day and I don't know why I'm telling you all of that but so now I overpack on underwear anyways next this is just gonna have stuff I know I want to take but I haven't really like done anything with it. Um, so I do pack a robe, a good book, and this is my carry-on bag that we need to put crap in. Um, and, and then I did make a few purchases, so I have some things that I know I'm taking for the trip in shoes I purchased for the trip. We are going to, why don't I just put you on the tripod? Why am I holding you? Like, I don't understand. Welcome to my bed. So we are going to Mexico and we will be at an all-inclusive resort for about five days and six nights. We've kind of done this for about a few years now. We don't always go to Mexico, but we do travel a lot and we do stay at resorts mostly. We really don't like to go on cruises. Let's talk about these shoes that I purchased for the trip. They were a last minute find at Good Old Marshalls. Uh, they're super cute. They're from a band, Margaritaville? I don't know, but they're cute. Um, so I did see, need some good walking shoes and I feel like these are it because we are staying like within the city of Playa. Our hotel is about two blocks from the beach. So there's a lot of shops, a lot of entertainment. There's gonna be a lot of walking and I needed a good pair of shoes that I could take. Uh, next, I purchased these interesting sandals from TJ Maxx last night. I do like the thicker sole. So when we're out in Mexico, I don't want my foot so close to the ground. Like that's just gross. I, I needed some sandals with some cushion. Uh, and then this cute top. Why is this a haul? All of a sudden, I'm supposed to be back. I promise I'm gonna pack because I need to pack because we leave tomorrow and it's like seven o'clock at night. I'm just started. Now this cute little beach top. I'm gonna wear it as like a, a top with some. Have that. That's from TJ Maxx. Everything else you see is from TJ Maxx, unless I tell you otherwise. And then this really cute shirt on clearance. Like this is what I'm wearing to the airport, please. Yes, that is cute. Um, and then we have a another piece I got. This is gonna be a romper. It is full length and it fits my five one self, which is really hard to find a full length body suits that fit me. Cause I'm so short. Oh, and a last minute. Purchased by good old Amazon. Thank you, Amazon. Thank you, two-day shipping. It is a bathing suit. Because a lot of what I have is kind of old. I feel like it's old. Like, no one wants to see you rock on the same bathing suit for the past, you know, like five years. So this one is, link it bit low. It is a more full coverage. I don't like showing the cheeks out when I'm on vacation I'm just I'm just not that girl anyone who does I'm like here for it it's just not me I need um some kind of coverage back there like I just feel so exposed uh, and then just the cute simple plain Jane bikini top like you can't go wrong with a triangle you really can't it's just a staple so let's go to the closet let's grab some dresses that I know I want to take for the trip like 
guaranteed like in my head I've already decided they're coming and then that will determine how many other outfits I actually need because I haven't even done that part let's go to the closet welcome to the closet um let's find the dress this is just your cotton basic nude it's really cute really breathable and it's just a simple piece to throw on definitely taking that one and this is a little bit bolder it's about goes down to my knees and it's just a cute little evening time because uh, we do have dinner and I do like to look decent for dinner um, it's just a cute little dress for dinner and so I determine my outfits by what I'm wearing for that day um, you know whether we're going to the beach the pool whatever I want an outfit that I can have my bathing suit on underneath and then just take it off when we're at the beach or the pool or if we're gonna be out you know shopping and stuff and going out to bars then I, I need to account for that so I will need at least two out in the street outfits so to speak and then I will pack about four outfits for the beach or the pool and I'll need a dress or some kind of full length bodysuit or something for evening. And then of course my airport outfit to go and come back. Uh, and then this is going to be a cute, cute, can you see that detailing? Like that's cute. Is that Ross? It was $6 and it's a cute flattering length and in the middle of the dress that actually ties right under your boobs. So it just gives you that like, mm, like really cute. And I'll definitely need some wedges for this dress because this dress is too cute. And I'll probably wear this one to dinner. So there's two dinner dresses. These are two like beach pool outfits. This is actually another romper. I like one piece outfits when we're traveling. So I'm not having to fuss like, wait, what shorts was I gonna wear with that top? Like, you know, it's just like the piece is here and all I have to worry about is if I'm gonna wear wedges or my jewelry. You know, my husband's like waiting on me so I need stuff that's like, yes. Like, I know what I'm wearing kind of. And then this is gonna be a beach cover up. Definitely taking that. Now that I have those, we have two night dresses. I need five night outfits total. And then we have two. I'm going to pack this dress but i don't know if i'm gonna wear it it's been a while i don't know how it fits and i'm too lazy to try it on i think it should be okay because i have lost some weight uh but we're gonna pack it and this will just be like a backup to have I definitely take this romper it is gonna be one of my uh swimsuit cover-ups for like whole day I do have one pair of shorts that i already have in my suitcase they're Levi's they're like a nude wash so I'm definitely taking those I just need to find the other two pairs of shirts okay now that we're back I am gonna pack these American Eagle shorts uh, they're super comfortable and then of course I think we already talked about these Levi ones I found these at Ross I've already worn them so um that's why they look all sad because I air dry them like what do I do with them uh, and then we found this cute cute cover-up it's not really a cover-up but I'm gonna use it as a cover-up I'm gonna wear shorts underneath it of course but I'll just have my uh, bathing suit underneath it's just a cute simple lace really excited about that one and then this is another so this next one is gonna be this cute cute detailed top it's crop top so it's super cute i'll wear this one day when we're like going through the city and stuff so cute with these shoes and then uh i'll probably do the i i, I don't know which short i won't know till the day of it's probably gonna be the lighter shorts i think what else did i find basic white top never go wrong it's a crop and then another i really like the material of this uh crop top as well and I love to wear white uh, because it's gonna be extremely hot can you see like just like the detail in here and it's just this nice little like thick material uh, this is gonna be super cute for when we're on the streets one day I can just throw this on 
with my hat. Hold on, let me go get my hat. So I picked up this cute little beauty from Nordstrom's online. It's a Vince Komodo hat and look at it. Like how cute is that? It's just cute. Like who am I? Who am I? Yes, I'm here for it. It's gorgeous. And it's like, I'm not sure what this material is. It's very forgiving and I really appreciate that because it doesn't lose its shape no matter what I do to it. And I really appreciate that, especially when you're traveling, you know? So this is gonna be super cute with maybe this top and then I feel like I should have black shorts. I might grab a pair of black shorts just for this outfit because that is coming with us. All right, next, I think that's it. I just need to double check, make sure I have enough daytime and nighttime outfits and oh my airport outfits which is super easy to do my airport port outfit and because like i said i'm gonna wear this shirt comfy but i want cute you know i i want the best of both worlds here i'm gonna pack this all in my suitcase real quick and when i come back cover what's in my carry-on okay i am back so my battery on my camera died and I had to charge it of course and then I had to drop off my dog at um, the dog sitter and I ended up doing some stuff around the house and finished packing actually like just like focus packing you know because it is like what time is it right now? It's midnight. Um, I own this place and three more like it. <laughs> it's my audible. I was listening to while I was packing. Um, I'm reading Darker by uh, E.L. James, as told by Christian. Um, so it's really good, and I'm reading it right now, and then I'm also going to read the actual book while I'm listening to it right now, and then I'm going to read the actual book. So let me just show you what I have real quick so I can wrap up this video and wash my face and go to bed. I went ahead and... <sighs> finished packing my uh, what did I leave off of that? I forgot. Um, adding my I got this bathing suit from Target by the way, super cute. Let me show you real quick. Um, it has the underwiring, which I'm really not a fan of, but the actual like this mauvey pink is really cute. Um, and they had my size and then like the detail on it for the hardware. I mean, look at that. That is super cute. Um, let me just grab it real quick to show it to you. It's just a cute little top. And I also got the matching bottom. Put the rest of my shoes in here. I do wear a uh, sandal in the hotel room. So I just have these like little cute, nothing special sandals, really inexpensive. I, I can't stand my feet touching that hole. Um, I put my selfie stick in here and then I am gonna take this cute, cute belt. Uh, in case I need it for a pair of shorts, um, just some beach shoes. Well, I count these as beach shoes just because the sand comes off so easily because of the material that it is, so that's really nice jump rope to work out and then I did pack a resistance band as well in here and I over here let me unpack this real quick ended up adding my shirt to come back from the airport in I am gonna just wear some leggings I think I chose my Whitney Simmons Gymshark leggings I'm not sure I think they're on the other side actually um and that really is all I've added. And this is gonna be it's gonna be part of my carry-on. My carry-on is completely at capacity. So I have some just cute little festive earrings to go along and makeup. I was gonna put this in the room, but it's not gonna fit, so I'm not sure how I'm gonna pack that. I do wanna show you real quick. I went to Target because of course Target was next door to my dog sitter and I was waiting on her. So my husband stayed in the car with our dog and I went into Target and got this really cute, besides that bathing suit, 
this really cute rope. And I, I need to take you to the other room so you can see how cute this robe actually is. Because it's still in stock, you need to go get it. Like, it's the cutest thing. Which has nothing to do with traveling, but it's, it's look at the robe. Okay, so let's go real quick. So, in my bathroom, this cute, what's the brand? The brand is, is stars above, and it was 29 bucks. It has pockets, and I think that's why I love it so much. And it just it sits perfectly. I am 5'1". And then this is just going to be the detailing on it. They also have PJs in this collection that are the same material. Um, so it's that same soft, comfy material. And I saw the rope and I was like, hmm, how much was the rope? Like 30 bucks? Yeah, 30 bucks. I was like, oh. I went to Target to look at the bathing suits to exchange another one. And then I saw the robe and I was like, oh, I need to get the robe. I mean, the pockets, the pockets, the pockets. Gotta love you some pockets, especially in a robe. It's super cute. Um, and then I just had black. They had different colors. They had blue. They had a gray if I'm not mistaken. I did see a gray. Anyways, I am going to show you real quick what I put in my like toiletry bag so to speak um so that we can end this video because I am ready to go to bed so ready this is just a uh bag smart bag here I am, I'll just pop up on the screen a few of the items that I have in here and just to show you so my cleanser thing because I noticed when I do travel my face will sometimes freak out and just go bonkers on me. I also need to pack my sleep mask and my brush. This is just the wet brush. My bum bum cream, because I do like to put this on, especially if I'm gonna be out in the sun. Do order it, of course. I'm just taking a, um, I guess a deep conditioner as my conditioner. And then a leave-in conditioner in case we go to the pool. Especially if I'm gonna be getting in the water. Do have highlights so of course we have moisturizer i kind of just think of my routine as i do it in order and then pack according to that so i don't forget anything there's nothing like being on vacation and forgetting something so important and i also i know there are oh scissors so this doesn't go in my carry-on because my husband does check in his bag so i get that luxury of packing stuff you know you typically wouldn't travel with, but I do take a pair of scissors and they've helped me out so many times. Whether it is to like trim my falsies or cut tags off stuff, I always find use for my scissors. If not, then I just brought scissors. Not a big deal. And then of course I have three containers of sunblock. Um, this one's really nice. It's just kind of like everywhere. So make sure that you're going to be at the actual pool and you don't mind if it gets on your clothes. It's my only downfall with this one. It is almost done too. Ready to finish it. And then I, I'm trying to finish the sunscreen as well. I actually think that I am done. Uh, only thing I need to pack in the morning really is my toothbrush. Uh, it's still charging right now. And that's it. That's absolutely everything. I'm probably gonna lay in bed real quick and just make sure I got everything. I don't know if I'm gonna vlog it. I might. Great. Well, um, I hope you enjoyed this video. And then if you liked it, please hit that like button and leave me a comment down below if you want to see more videos or if you just want to tell me hi. You know. Uh, I hope you have a great day or evening. And.